All right, man, so we're here at Azteca Boxing Gym with Saul Sanchez. Tell us uh, what's happening January 15th. January 15th, my pro debut. And I'm really excited to finally show for my first professional fight. So you're making your pro debut. What kind of emotions have you been, you been going through? Um, I'm excited to find a show to show everybody. Okay. All right. Um, do you have any nerves? Yeah, a little, a little bit. Nervous. Is it nerves to be in a boxing match, to, to be in a fight, or is it just nerves that it's your pro debut? It's both. Like I'm nervous. And I'm excited. I'm more excited. So who is your opponent, and what do you know about him? I didn't know he's, he's from Mexico. Okay. Do you know if he's had more fights or is this his pro debut too? He has two fights. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Is there anything that he could do that you won't be ready for? Is there anything that he could do that you won't be ready for? Yeah. You ready for everything? Yeah, I'm ready. I'm the same part. Alright. If you could write the script of how it's going to happen on January 15th, how would you write it? How would it play out? Right. Just figuring him out in the first round to test power and just, then the second round probably just take him out. Alright, that's cool. So, talk about you being here to spar. How have these sessions been going? How have your sparring sessions been going? As we've been going there, I've been doing six rounds. Six rounds and the condition is today. Is there a difference between sparring now that you're a pro and sparring when you were an amateur? Yeah, an amateur I used to just go like four rounds. Now I'm doing more rounds. But okay, and you feel comfortable with that? Yeah. Tell us about your gym and where you train at. I train Parson, The Rock, Parson. And there's a lot of um, upcoming fighters like Oscar Valdez, Terrell Boucher, and there's a lot of team fighters. Okay, and I, Who, who's your head trainer? Many roles. Okay, how long have you been with him? And for a, a year. Okay. Did he work with you in your amateur career? No. I, I'm barely starting to work with him. Okay. What is it like to be fighting on the last round promotions inaugural card? I'm excited. This is fun, so. This one's about your boxing skills. What do you feel is your, your best skill out in the ring? My best thing is box, boxing, moving around the ring. I could, I could bang too, but it's better to be smart in the ring than box. Have you ever been hit or really hurt? Um, no. So would you say you have a strong chin? Tell me about your chin, like what you can endure in the ring. I, I think I could keep a hit, yeah. Awesome, awesome. Um, is there anybody you'd like uh, to especially like thank, uh, you know, your gym, your coaches, your trainers, you go ahead and uh, send a shout out. To thank my, my family, my parents, for what I'm going to be here, like, pros and my trainers. I want to know a little bit more about you. If you could just tell me, like, what kind of a person are you inside of the ring and outside of the ring? Uh, at first, I started boxing when I was eight. I just think it's right. What was it that, that caught you and you were like, this is what I want to do? Well, at first I seen my big brother and he, he started boxing and I seen how happy uh, my parents were. And I just wanted to give it a try. And, you know. That's it? Alright, thank you, bro. Awesome, bro. Thank you so much.